Hey everybody, this is uh, Gex, Enter the Gecko. We're doing this for replay. My name's Philip Kohler. And oh I'm, I'm being joined by Benjamin Reeves. That is me, Tim Turry. Hi. And Andrew Reiner. What, what is... That was a baby jaguar. <laughs> I guess so. Noise. Baby jaguar. <laughs> what is that thing? So oh this, is a, this is a PS1 era 3D platformer. From 1998 it looks like. Yes. The only, hmm. the only thing I like. know about this game, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be honest with all of you. I read about this game a lot in EGM and in uh, GI, old issues of those magazines. And I was, whenever I read about this game, I was like, this looks awesome. I wish that I owned this. Yeah. And I never, I never played it. Too bad you didn't. Your life would have been well, better. I mean, you, were you into pop culture at the time? I mean, like movies and, a little and TV bit, shows and not stuff? Not that much. I was kind of a dumb kid for that. So. That, was a, that was a selling point right there for these things. I mean, how dumb of a kid were you if you weren't even into TV? That thing. He's actually probably pretty, pretty smart then, I think. Yeah. I, all I reading did was books. read books yeah. and uh, wrote Here. a couple plays. You were an idiot. Um, made some investments. Oh. Are you sure about giving the controller to Ben? Uh, so Ben is actually a fan of the series, right, Ben? Yeah. That's what you said. Like is, would, you call, would you consider yourself like a Gexpert? Look at this. Like, Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. Yeah. Would you, would you oh consider boy. yourself Tim. one? Why is Tim always on would the podcast? Start that off right away. <laughs> what did you say? You just keep asking. I'm, uh, your, would you I'm say that you have Gex Dream Gex skills? For Gex for Gex. Gexpertise. Uh, would you say that this to play this game it, re requires God. a lot of Gexterity? Get the Gex out of here. <laughs> ben, why aren't you looking at me? Ben. We, why are you touching are me? Could you like, leave me alone. click the button? Yeah, hit something. All right, let's yeah. do this. Jump right. to the teetering rock, Ben. Woo! So this ben. Is, a, is this a level of this the game This is Bugs now? Bunny inspired, right? This is right? a level of the Bunny. Oh, you remember when that was cool, the wireframe <laughs> yeah. stuff? Oh, boy. What? It shows it's like ten polygons. You're now missing all the cool dialogue. Can you make a, a Jerry Garcia joke? Yep. Yes. We get weird that little... Clever. Who's that for? Oh, my God. <laughs> for the HBO crowd. <laughs> yeah, you know, those, those kids that used to watch, like, Oz and stuff and also play Gex. We get weird little one-liners from, well, uh... So Gex is actually voiced by Dana Gould, right? Yeah, comedian. HBO comedian. Hilarious. Well, where would I know them He was from? on SNL. I don't, what HBO. I don't, well, I don't know if he's on That's why I made that joke. Oh, okay. you name a show? He's an HBO comedian. Gosh. He was on Comedy Central. Did he play any old roles where he's a character that you could name? Dana he was Gould. Dana Gould. He played hey. Gex. He was oh, Dana Gould oh, as right. Dana Gould. This reminds me of the beginning area from Banjo-Kazooie, kind of. <laughs> Fiberglass carrots. Clipping action. Look at these. With baby carrots. So why were you a fan of this series, Ben? <laughs> yeah, I don't even remember. What does Ben do? I was, uh... <laughs> ben, your humor kind of reminds me of Gex. Of Gex? It aged, aged yeah, uh, poorly. Uh, Dana Gould? <laughs> 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 Alright. <laughs> it's sour before it's done. <laughs> <laughs> what? I don't know. Well, Case in point. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> this looks like Green Hill Zone texture. Oh, gosh. They got me. They threw the kitchen sink at me. Everything goes back to Sonic. It always does. You guys are That'd be a good feature you could write for the site. Everything All goes these back games to inspired Sonic. by Sonic. Yeah. Even the ones before it. <laughs> oh, is that how you get into a level? We're already Why in the you level. Try jumping on it. It's a platform game. <laughs> is that what you do in those? You may have had a splinter. So this is not actually the first Gex game. Some there was a. Yep. There's a previous Gex game for the 3DO that came out in 1994. It was and a side I, I believe scroller. Also ported to the PlayStation One later, but yeah, that was a that was like a 2D side scroller. Yeah. Do you know if that one like parodied movies and TV shows too, or was that uh... not to this extent? Yeah, okay. not like this. Hey, look, see now I'm you're a rabbit. Bunny. What? It's amazing. Or are you the ah. Energizer Bunny? He Poor choice of color, right? Going. He looks like a looks like a rabbit that's trying to pass a very a uncomfortable, awkward ball movement. So this is a this is like a Looney Tunes parody. Is what oh, we're doing. Cameras here. in this. He looks terrible. like a rabbit that ate a lizard and is now trying to pass that lizard. <laughs> so this game's made by like every big person in the video game industry, except Shigeru Miyamoto. What, what happened? So the lead designer is uh, Evan Wells, who's at Naughty Dog working on Uncharted. This is it was Crystal Dynamics. So who's yes. Crystal Dynamics at the time? He was the lead designer uh, on this. Yeah, the director is Glenn Schofield. Wow! Oh, wow! Dead Space guy. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, you could pretty much link Dead Space most of the key talent in the industry right now. Not most of it, but a, a lot of it. All of it. Let's just say all, all of, of it. it. We'll say all of it except Miyamoto because he's a hack. To Crystal Dynamics. Miyamoto did some consulting on this game. 
We well, stole all the ideas. I'm gonna get these. Everyone started with training I mean, wheels. This is Pikmin, wow. basically. This is basically Pikmin. Look, killer flowers. And a little bit of a little. You can see a lot of uh, Super Mario Galaxy 2. Oh, yeah, took the colors from this. The colors, the, the fun protagonist. <laughs> the fun <laughs> Dana Gould. Dana Gould is in yep. Super Mario Galaxy 2. Uh, unlockable. It's well, funny. Think, think about like the the voice actor for Mario. Is it Charles something? Charles like? Martin. Charles Broden. Yeah. yeah. That guy is like way fi- more famous than I'd say like than this Dana Gould character. <laughs> Only like, for you. Like think about think about right. um think about like the voice acting that went into this. Like how many lines of dialogue have happened throughout the Gex series, and then that Charles idiot just says it's a me Mario, <laughs> and like hey man, you probably a millionaire. <laughs> Good work. Uh, so there you go. That time I did yeah. it. I, I just hit him with my tail. Sorry, there's a game going on here. Well done. I think what I liked about this game is it was pretty creative, and there's a lot of stuff going on. They aped a lot of different stuff. There was some Godzilla stuff. and It's pretty creative, but they aped a lot of stuff. Like King Kong? <laughs> yeah, you know. Like you do. Aren't you supposed to eat that? Those are like chain chomps. You see, Miyamoto took those. Yep. Stole them. Uh, What's so going on here? He borrowed them. Eat, eat that bug. What? There you go. What did you just say? Come on. Oh. I thought he said the F word. There are a lot of collectibles here. Do we know what they're doing? Yeah, good question. This was I think that era. Yeah, it's the era of probably a hundred of these Just collect things. everything. What do you say is the apex of the collectathon game? Uh, it's got to be Donkey Banjo Kong 64, 64 right? I mean, like, in a good yeah. way. In a oh. way, like, the last game that... I thought you meant, like, the one that's... I enjoyed... The uh, <laughs> I think that killed it. I enjoyed oh, Banjo-Kazooie. That's what I was going to say. I thought say. Banjo-Tooie also was... They, going they for the Jingles was a lot of fun. Yeah. Speaking of Banjo Kazooie, I love that game. Yes. And uh, Banjo Tooie, I actually loved it. And then I remember reading the Game Informer review when I was younger, and they mentioned that the frame rate was slower in the first game. And then that's all I could see after I read that <laughs> review. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was my review. Game Informer yeah, ruined your yeah, I'm childhood. Sorry. Oh man, Reiner, you secretly ruined him's childhood. <laughs> uh, I never finished that game. Uh, I'm glad I was Sonic's a part of your childhood. Now. Yeah, you were. I mean, I just got to know you like a year or two ago. Oh, that, that was, was a that bad time idea. Outside my, my Why did I do that? You, I have terrible my timing. Parents called the cops. Oh wait, that was that was, a that was you? I, I thought I repressed that. Uh, hmm. yeah, that was my window, dude. Oh, huh. wow. Boing. Anyway, back to Gex. So, so what do you think of this game again, Tim? <laughs> What'd you say? What do you think of this game? <sighs> it's uh pretty fun looking. Wait, why are you back here? Would you play it? He, he died, died again. I love this area. Oh, I don't know. I feel like that's already, all there is to this game. You're already this you know, one area familiar with the controls. I feel like you should probably pass it on to Tim. He's not a uh, I'll play expert. <laughs> There you go, Tim. So now you're collecting TNT? Maybe you, you should go to a Gex therapist and talk to them about wow. your issues. That's just, that just give up the stretch. stretch. You know what? This has uh, analog enabled. All you gotta do is yep. hit that little button, and now it's way better. Way better? <laughs> Dummy. <laughs> what? How do you use your tongue? I think it's on that one out. <laughs> so, uh, did I, did I hurt you? Oh, it's just his, it's his grab. Just like Nathan Drake. Just like that's how he does it. Oh, what? he got hit. Oh, is this how Why the didn't tables you avoid turn that? here? Ben? Yeah. What no, is know? it your turn to bring it on? Shoe is on the other foot. The other gex. It wouldn't fit. Hmm. Mm. Just gonna sit back and watch this. <laughs> yeah, I don't really understand what's happening. I'm just letting you guys go at it. Jump on it. I will. I'll do that. All right. All right. I really did it this time. So, so I didn't really play the first one. Um, did anybody here play the first one? Come yes, on. I did. How was on th- it? On 3DO. Uh, oh, you what did you expect 3DO. from a 3DO game? So it was awesome. Hey, you know, it was one of the better games on 3DO. It was a pretty straightforward platformer. I but it had look. some really challenging, like, three-dimensional segments where the environment was 3D, but you were still doing uh, 2D actions in it, and they just couldn't get it down right. Uh, what if they resurrected Gex on the new Panasonic Jungle handheld device? Well, it would have to be an MMO. That's true. So do you think the the god of the world would be Dana Gould? Oh, like oh, actual Dana Gould? right there. It didn't even move. That would be... <laughs> How did you not avoid that? That's, That's what I, get I would hit expect. Again. I mean, he's not doing anything, I right? I was nowhere near that. This is not going well. This is really about your father, isn't it? Checkpoint. Nice. Brilliant. So we're halfway. Beware the poop. Things are gross. Looks like it's from Plants vs. Zombies. Yeah, that's wind. Is that, is that how a wind looks? Okay, so those guys can punch you. That means I can't turn the camera. <laughs> you can, with Eleanor. What's tongue? Uh, circle, I think. 
You do it automatically. Nope, oh, circle. Whoa! Alright, that happened. What? Uh, what? what? Oh, I guess that's bad. That's gonna try to hit you too. There's just nonsense going on. It's switching to like a wily e. coyote type thing. Like Red Dead Redemption. It's parodying that actually. Ahead of its time. Amazing. Why are you collecting TNT now? Before it was like soda cans. I think it's just supposed to fit into the cartoon. Isn't there a way to... But it's it switched. Yeah, I don't know what the thing with the S was. Could that have been spinach, like Popeye or something? Or Yeah, that's possible. Geckos love spinach. That's how you can feed them. Oh, camera. Dear God, stop it. Man, Come a long way now. Yeah, no joke. Oh. Hey ho! It's tail time. It's tail time, boys. So says Dana Gould. Alright, here we go. Jumping into a new level. Scream TV Scream smell TV. razor. This, this game is just full of the funny jokes. Fun puns. Fun puns, yeah. So this is gonna be a horror themed one. It beats the Matterhorn, what are you gonna do? What? <laughs> what did he say? <laughs> what? Something about the Matterhorn? <laughs> Isn't that a mountain? There are a lot of, uh... What does that sign say there? No haunting before 10pm. Oh, look, totally new collectible. What? Look at that. The skull. Yeah, skulls. It's, it's a theme. It's it a new world. The Getting skulls. Yes. Like so that basically them. just means there's like 50 different collectibles in the game, one for each world. Yes. So we saw Hellraiser... Or maybe two per world. Hellraiser, Smellraiser, and Frankenstein and Seinfeld become Frankensteinfeld? That totally makes sense to me. I like it. Oh, jump. I remember it being a big deal that he was quoting uh, Duke Nukem and Ash from Army of Darkness. Oh, really? Yeah, I just remember all my friends thinking it was hilarious. So that's all you gotta do in the game is quote, quote Army Ash, of Darkness and Ash. Uh, yeah. It worked out for Duke Nukem really well. That sounds like doesn't, your fan, your friends, rather. Doesn't Nukem also <laughs> quote something from uh, the movie They Live, that John Carpenter movie? Yeah. Is that the bubblegum line? The came here to kick ass. Yeah. Bubblegum, yeah. I'm a whole lot of gum. Where is it? Which. <laughs> That's a pretty good Duke Nukem impression. Oh, you should hear Jeff Corks. He's got it. He's got Duke it Nukem does it way better. Because oh, I remember going back and watching that old right movie. There. They Live or whatever it was. And oh. It's terrible. They Live isn't that great. But I want to hear him say that now. There's a, there's a little Frankenstein zombie monster thing. Reiner, how'd you get on fire? Uh, you haven't been paying attention, clearly. You may have been talking about Duke Nukem a little. Is that a power-up? Yes. Do you know what it actually does? Fire starter? Is it just me or am I engulfed in flame? <laughs> That's kind of funny. You know, like yeah. for comedic value. They knew they were engulfed in flame. What happened to his head? Oh. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I was really confused there. Whoa. So the camera work is atrocious. Yeah. Oh, what? what Could use some work. What's over here? <laughs> it doesn't seem like there's anything. That's a. Just didn't finish that part. That was a waste. Maybe I could fall down there. Maybe that's like part uh, of it. Yeah, so yeah. yeah, I can climb up here. You've been playing games for a long time, huh? Huh. But this cracked a little. I've been doing that, I don't know why. I'll Listen, just... Tim. Uh, Full disclosure. When you get older, you oh go through God. some changes. Oh, puberty joke. Yep. I'm yep. ready. That's what I want with. <laughs> Step, into, Step into the light. Step into the light. Blinded by the light. Checkpoint, Ripped guys. All right. Boom. Another I'm really glad that Reiner is playing. Night. Yeah, I'm pretty good. Seems like you know what you're doing. Like, step into the light. I'm in the light. Green means go. Getting what? Spaced? Oh, oh boy, oh. run from that thing. Oh, survival horror game. You didn't think it'd turn on you like yeah, this, no, did you? No, it's tombstones. Just, One of my favorite horror theme collecting. levels was, uh, I think it was a Garfield game? What? Or was it, uh... <laughs> Cool spot. I can't remember. I played a lot of weird games. I only had a Genesis, so I wasn't able to play. You only like had Mega a Genesis. And you only played licensed games on it, apparently. <laughs> so my parents, my parents would only ever rent me anything that they recognized and that we were buying on the same trip. But uh, yeah, actually, the Cool Spot came from Genesis, and uh, Garfield Caught in the Act were pretty solid games. I remember Cool Spot. I really liked Cool yeah. Spot. Games underrated. Yeah. But anyway, I don't know why I'm talking about that thing. It was fast. 
Uh, you said there was a horror themed level that you liked. He, he didn't talk like Gex. Jack o' Lantern was Whoa, Jack oh careful of fire. Okay. So, yeah, I don't know. I'd uh, I'd play Gex again if they remade it. Alright, step in the light. What does that do for me? I think the ghost cannot get you while you're in the light. I feel like Gex would be like the next game that they'd try to like do a downloadable Which way, relaunching. Guys? Yeah, like, would you guys that play way. a reboot of this? Do you think this is a series that could work? As, as oh, Lisa. That's oh, is this going to be, like, one of those Disney rides? Turn it these on. these things change? Ooh. I don't know, Phil. It'd have to be pretty edgy if they did that. They'd have to, like, amp edgy. it up. <clears throat> only edgy. if they get Dana Gould again. Edgy. Yeah, only Dana Gould. Or Dana Carvey. Edgy is my favorite buzzword. I just really like <laughs> whenever anybody, like, whenever a video game creator or anyone else really can use that in a sentence. And, like... Keep a straight face. <laughs> edgy. Like, uh, kind of like, uh, what's it, Poochie from yeah. Simpsons? Is that what they yeah. keep on calling him, Edgy? Uh, let's see if we can get to another level. Star Wars level. I just sure. got it on, according to Gex. www.com. So, I get it. This was, like, right in the middle of the dot-com crash, too. The crash or the boom? <laughs> when did it crash? The dot com crash boom. What is a the boom crash? The kaboom? wild. <laughs> the kaboom crash. crash. I mean, things crash on a daily basis. That's true. But doesn't uh, look like we can get in any other levels right now unless uh, we have one more. Oh, we probably need. And that gets us into Gilgan's Island. Yeah, like Gex Island. Oh, that's not even what. <laughs> <laughs> that one's confusing. I let's be honest. Given time. You would have come up with that. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Gilligex? <laughs> Gilligex. No. What does that mean? Isn't that a new razor? Basically, you were one of the writers on this game. <laughs> you were they, eight. They looked in my journal. <laughs> my stupid, stupid journal. Yes. yes. What? Was that? Hunt the two hunters. So I gotta kill two hunters. Yeah. We've sure. seen those. Oh, so you just go through the same level and do different objectives. Seen those guys. Maybe. Sort of like Mario 64? Yeah, a bit. I think so. I used to want to be ah. Bugs Bunny when I was a kid. To be him? I wanted to become him. <laughs> uh, Why? I don't know, I really liked him. I liked how violent he was. That yeah. might explain some of my, uh... Outbursts? Yeah, some of my rage issues, yeah. yeah. Also a Sylvester. I wanted to be Sylvester. We would go back and forth. You remember when What about Pepe, Bunny? Le, Pepe Le Pew? Used to dress up like a girl bunny? Did you ever find him attractive? Did you find him attractive? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> no, me neither. <laughs> me neither. You know what movie that's from? Yeah. Alright, I, I do. Know. Gilligax. I do know what movie that's from. I started quoting it. I could still rock this game. I'm the one that first started quoting Wayne's World. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> the first one in the world. Alright, quiet guys. He's going to say something funny here. Oh, Tiki Bros. <laughs> He didn't say anything. No, he didn't. He looks like a boss. Or grunted or something. Yeah, I guess this is a boss fight. Hey, you guys, he looks well, look like Gilligan. Gilligan. Yeah, he dressed different now. Oh, it's crazy. I think I have to hit those blue ones. Got back. a hat on. <laughs> Dana Gould. What are those sounds? You crazy. Wait, so they get hit by blue fire and jump? I can't believe I remember, remember this. Listen, don't overthink this. Are you still trying to keep up with the uh, the Gex lore these days? <laughs> well, actually, yeah, we should do a fiction. special podcast, Gex podcast. Yeah, people would listen to that. Get some of the old devs on. <laughs> the true history of Gex. Oh, is that it? What was it? Wow, Man, them, I can't believe I remembered uh, that. You tore them apart. Pretty impressed by that. That just came right back to me. I that was amazing. I mean, it was only what like <laughs> it was only what like six or seven years what? ago. <laughs> When did this come out? 98. Nine, yeah, 98. Oh, jeez. So it was 12 Let's years ago. Let's here. See if I'm going to sleep well tonight. Look at that, a gate yeah, opened right. up. Let's check this out. Because you're going to play this all night and then fall asleep. Mm. Let's just go all the way with this one. Where were you going with that, Tim? Not, I'm not you guys got going on. <laughs> <laughs> but all those things we've done. No, that's. Uh, I, you, I'm not going all whoa. the way. Ah, that's what I was hearing. Wow, look oh, at all this. Oh, there's the Chinese level. I totally remember the Chinese level. What's this one? The Chinese level. I don't know. It's got Chinese food on it. To the right. Something. Mm. Pork. Pork. Camera. Chew. Camera. Ugh. Oh, it's Kung Fu. Okay, that oh. one's open. What else do we got oh. open? Oh, oh, that one's fun, too. Oh, this one's good. 
This is the... Is it fun? I don't even know. I don't even remember. Oh, maybe this isn't the one I thought it was. Dot com. This is the dot com. No, this doesn't crash. sound fun. This sounds well, tough. Sounds like a lot of platforming. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, God. Uh, this is looking pretty awful. Let's give it a shot. We might, we might give up, though, and move on to the roulette. Well, do you want me to give it a shot? Or do you want shot. Tim to... I'll do it. Tim, give it a shot. Because that will end the, the replay, probably. That's... I'm ready. No offense. Uh, are you feeling really after going back to this, Reiner? Uh, what are your What are your thoughts on the going back to the game? I mean, these early 3D games don't hold up very well just because developers camera. were still learning about camera and clipping and just how to navigate 3D space. Yeah, I have so, with this right here. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm just exemplifying the camera and how it it craps the bed sometimes. Uh, but it's it's still kind of fun, you know. I like I love platformers, and I love this era of of platformers. Of course, we uh, all love Dana Gould. You know, I think the in in my opinion, the last really great platformer was Jack and Daxter. Oh, that was such a great platformer. Uh, and what about good. the Ratchet and Clank games, though? Well, they're more shooter than straight up platforming. Yeah, that's true. I can see that. that. Well, oh, I guess yeah. Those those are great. But that's Nintendo. But that's kind, kind of, of a continuation own. of the Mario 64 sure. legacy. But in terms of new franchises, we don't get them anymore. Yeah, that is true. What's going on with these things? I don't know. You could probably know. jump Climb kick across that. What was that uh, jump and it's then square? L, it's oh, L2 yeah. and jump at the same time, but pushing in a direction. Oh, God. This is going to be good. You can do it. I can tell this is going to be good. I can believe in you. Jeez. Yeah! Ah, uh, that's it. We're done. Find that. Find that. Rending on that. Oh, look at that. That's, so, that's what geckos do. That is gex. Enter the gecko. I'm sorry, guys. This is a video game. <laughs> Change color. I'll just hide over here. That's a chameleon. <laughs> just hide. Oh. Great. Gex, chameleons. We'll be back with the replay roulette. Alright, we're back for a replay roulette. <laughs> Tim, you're making a very funny face. Uh, you have the controller. This is Sabrina the Teenage Witch, a Twitch in time. <laughs> you want the credits. <laughs> we Tim, you the game. Chatfield, this is your fault. I'm blaming this on you. <laughs> Alright, let's... Can you skip this? Alright. <laughs> what did you do? Oh, oh my boy. gosh. It's like alone in the dark. This is amazing. Look at... It's Melissa Joan Hart. Is that who that is? That is. Very nicely done. She's actually a pretty attractive well girl. What? She's a good looking girl. After, uh... Oh, uh what, what the that? heck is that? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. I'm not miss one itty bitty file, Sabrina. Remember that cat? Oh, what's the cat's name? Stupid Let's dumb cat really that talks to her in a bubble. Talking definitely cat. watched the show for a while when it was bubble. on, uh... Talk Cat. E-G-I-F. That's thank you. That funny. Did you hear that stupid sitcom music? <laughs> we need more of that in video games, I feel like. <laughs> what is this? Oh. <laughs> they can't just try to walk into a oh my God. Listen, Whoa. they have to have a lot of context Bad for this cat. game. I'm loving this. Con this is Gex. great. I want to go back and play this right now. What's, right. what's that guy doing? I wonder where his hit zone Look is. Look at that cat hole he's got in his <laughs> How do you defeat him? <laughs> Jump into my tummy. So, are we going to be playing Sabrina or the cat, do you think? I vote... I want to play that guy. Both. I'm going to say both. Rescuing the cat? Oh, yeah, you might be right. He's going in the cat hole. The cat, yeah. That's his new energy source. Oh. Oh. Zipper oh, that is. Ooh. That cat hole. Yeah. Mm. So? And you broke the cosmic clock. God. It governs Ooh. all of time. Well, that and was space. the cosmic if clock. If it's broken, all of history can change. Meow. Yeah. You think yeah. anybody will notice? Of course. Hilarious. You, have to fix it. you will never succeed. Who's that guy? Why is he talking to them right now? Is that him talking to himself? Does he have one glowy tooth? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on there? <laughs> One Listen. middle tooth, Listen. one singular He's tooth. He's doing some dental work. <laughs> you don't need to judge. If you turn him upside down, he looked like a guy with a fro that was really sad. Yeah. That's probably what they're going for. So turn your computer monitors upside down when you see that part. Well, let's go. There's no time like the present. Well, 
Oh, oh boy. boy. This is... Ah, get it off. Look at things just as I'm not touching anything. That guy just having like a, like a small-time seizure. Just <laughs> what are they doing? Twitching, twitching it up right there. So is Sabrina. Uh, it is called a twitch in time, so... Is it really? Yeah. yeah. They break out the manual for this sucker. I can't move right now. They're talking still. Yeah. Give them a minute. When you look good, it's a lot like Mass Effect, response. really. There's a huge wow, go over right to the front again. Let's take a look at that face. Just what I mean. Give me a stretch. Ooh. Yeah, what are you doing? <laughs> Sexy. Ben. Oh, now it's time. There we go. We're to run animation. <laughs> All right, hit X. You gotta hit X. Oh boy. Ooh. She's got some jump. She goes off the screen. <laughs> That's not helpful. That's not doing. There anything. are four pages of story in the manual. Like this is. This, this is rich. All too much story kidding. for this game. Caveman Village. You have to go to. Oh, oh I got. I got to do it in, in order, guys. Oh, uh, what? Caveman you want to see Caveman? What would Caveman actually do if Melissa Joan Hart would do time? <laughs> they would <laughs> club her over the head with those orange would, pants. Yeah, yeah, the orange and brown polka dotted pants. Uh, you can only imagine Fred Flintstone or the Geico commercial guys. I don't remember her. <laughs> Gex actually ended up. That's what he did after his yes, career ended. That's right. I don't yeah. remember her wearing that on the show. Or when she went to the caveman pits. I don't remember surprise, that part of the Surprise, surprise, you're collecting stuff. Gems. I've always hated games that like make you be right up next to it. Like, oh, that doesn't count. Nope. Gotta be right in it. So, just to give you guys a hint of jump, what happens jump. throughout this game, I'm, I'm reading up. the manual here. What, else, what other direction would you jump? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, get away. How do you ah. jump down? <laughs> Throw magic at it. Oh, awesome. This, this looks great. Uh, so you go to the Stone Age, which You're is where you are magic. now. After that, you go to ancient Egypt. Yeah. You go to medieval What'd Japan. What'd you just get? Did you just get cigarettes? So, so we go to ancient away. Egypt after this? Uh, yeah, and me medieval Japan. Oh. And then the Wild West, of course. Why are we doing these Not things? too different than, um, than Gex. That's right. Uh, but then here's the thing where I, I, I really Gold's like... not in it. That's a disappointment. When you fight the final boss, they call it the Chaos Encounter. Apparently, you play a game of rock, paper, scissors with him. It's like uh, Alex Kid. <laughs> what? Alex That's Kid what it says in the, the manual? It says that in the manual. Why when you get to the last boss, it says? It says, what better way to solve a dispute than a game of rock, paper, scissors? Or, in this case, mouse, cat, elephant. What? That's real dumb. How do you make an yeah. elephant with your... With a cat. I don't, I don't know, man. Okay, I'll just magic. This thing the witch. Use right. your middle finger. Time to make a machine. Oh, yeah, there. Yeah, it's kind of middle elephant. I don't know oh, how you do that mouse. That's inappropriate. That's. I think you're choosing which animal to transform into. Maybe ah. they just told you how the game's gonna end in oh, the frame rate. manual, just so that you wouldn't be disappointed. Oops. <laughs> 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 so she's she's in the past. What she just took an that? egg. Wait. She's disrupting Are those time space. <laughs> Uh, the producers of the game thought dinosaurs just ran Wait. in circles. <laughs> that must be why they went extinct. Is that a Triceratops they just and a Willy circles. Mammoth in the same era? You call it a Willy Mammoth? A Willy Mammoth. <laughs> a Willy. A Willy. A Willy Mammoth. That specific one was Willy. What? Yeah, I can really see him. Hey, no fair. I got to run. Oh boy. Oop. How does uh, it control? <laughs> why didn't they do a super replay I, on this? Super loose and like. Dumb? I don't oh, know. Like Sabrina. It's super <laughs> loose and dumb. Hmm. Sabrina is super loose and dumb. Oh, I get it. <laughs> wow. That's Whoa. not what I was trying to say. Oh. Platforming. And I am. I'm offended. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. 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 <laughs> what was that? Whoa. Whoa. What do you. Who do you think you are? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> you fell through the world. Oh, oh this that? is terrible. <laughs> do it again. <laughs> Just plain awful. Do it again. Back you, let's I, see her face. Oh, get away. Oh. Oh. You get that camera down. Put it down. It doesn't look like it's she has a nose, does it? Camera doesn't. I don't think so. When they went, when they showed her face during that first cutscene, I was pretty terrified. This, this game feels like I feel like this game was like pulled together with scotch tape and popsicle <laughs> sticks. Like I feel like it's about to fall apart at any moment. <laughs> I think it just did when you died there. Okay. Shoot that thing, man! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Magic it. Durr. Magic it up. <laughs> Magic for everybody. Ow. I don't even care about this game. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, I'm not taking this playthrough seriously anymore. It seems like <laughs> well, you are. before, of course. Yeah, grab that thing, grab that book. What was that power up? Look, Look at that guys. HUD. Look at that arrow. <laughs> Look at that map. Look at that color. What does that mean? That arrow what is, is that? telling you where to go. Looks like a pathetic little firework. 
<laughs> it's not moving either. Oh, it's not. Maybe that's maybe that's your your magic spell. Can you switch spells somehow? Oh God, Phil, don't make me do this. <laughs> oh, you can. There you go. It's, Look how different it is. Look at it, it's so different. Oh my! Get away from me. Use that. That's you the shrink power. power. That's the shrink power. What, what is up with that one? What? <laughs> 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 oh. oh. I'm putting this controller oh, on. Oh, let's stop. So good. Let's yeah, stop there. Yeah. Hey, uh, turn people upside down. This seems like a really amazing game. I'm sure that we'll play lots more of it. If you want to play a loose and dumb game. If you want to check out her midriff. We'll be back. It's very sexy. With more replay next. Where do you buy those pants? I'd like you you got to have your agent ask talk. me first. So I'd like you to treat me like a baby yeah. jaguar. I want to be treated like Joe. I am very confused. What? That's not a baby jaguar. That's a wolf, dude.